Welcome to Sabiners.com. We are having so much fun here today, Javi. Oh my God, Amelia, I'm so excited to be here with you and uh, look what we're going to do today. The oysters, that yes. That is so easy, so fun to do and uh, you can do it. What I love about it is that you can do it after work, just hang out with your friends, um, have a glass of uh, Sauvignon Blanc from Teja Vineyards, which is a little bit crispier, refreshing, and uh, just perfect for the occasion. Oh yes, so um, we are going, we're lightly grilling these oysters, and you're going to demonstrate how to chuck an oyster. And then we're going to serve these oysters with a, a wonderful accoutrements. So we, uh, we have them already here in the grill. Uh, all we need to do is just leave them here for probably um, another um, three what, minutes. Three minutes. So let's just close this up for right now, and then we'll check back in just a little bit. So we're just going to show you when the oysters um, are ready. And uh, as you can tell, this one right here, it's bubbling a little bit. It's spilling a little bit of water out. So that means it's ready. So we're just going to grab that one, and I'm going to show you how to open it in the right way. So see how you bring the oyster to you? And then right where you see that the water was coming out, you insert your sharp knife. And look at this. Oh, my God. I can't wait to taste it. Oh. This is just so good. And then you just take the top off. Just be careful because it's kind of hot. And see how juicy that is? Oh, my God. And, and you still have to come back to it because there's um, you have to unplug it and come this way because we're going to show you what we do here at Seha. And um, this is the order that we're going to go. So we have a little bit of a lime. Just squish the lime here just to add that, a little nice acidity. Uh, the butter with a little bit of garlic. Oh my God, I can't wait to taste this. This is just so good. And then in a sunny day in the summer, oh my God. And this is the fire roasted tomato uh, to bring that uh, nice uh, spice component. And then we have uh, the cheese, cotija, to bring that creaminess and nice texture. A little bit of salt and the tapatio. This is gonna just add the last touch to it. And uh, See how that looks? It's just so yummy. And we're going to serve this with a I have a glass, ceja. a perfect glass of wine for you. Ceja Sauvignon Blanc. Oh, my God. And this is one of my favorites. How do you need that? With the oysters? Oh, well, you got to taste it. Oh, let's do it. Because uh, And then we still, mm. you see all of this that we have over here? We're going to eat them, each and every one of those fabulous oysters. So um, definitely tune in to all of our future blogs because we're always going to bring you something that is so enticing and inviting and most importantly we want you to come and visit us in this beautiful location mm -hmm. in Carneros, Napa Valley and uh, check our check also our Facebook page how is it it's delicious it's just a little warm right now but let's see how this tastes like You gotta try, mm. try, try with the. Mm, amazing. Oh. And a little bit of this Avignon Blanc. Oh my God. This is like heavens. Come and see us here. You have a lot of fun. <laughs>